skimming stones on the water and watching each one drop into my stomach like I imagine you dropping onto the ground and feeding them. And the splash ricochets upwards like my heart to my throat when I'm convinced I'm dying from a disease no one knows about. When my panic attack is a heart attack in my head so I'm checking my vitals believing I'll be dead any moment. Because if nothing stays why should my pause? When the odds are a million to one, then it's supposed to tell me that I could never be that one. Because to me, in my brain, I'm already gone, I'm already cycling over the gravel and my grave. Because human error is possible. We make mistakes, we miss things, we promise things, things we can't keep, we presume, we assume, and then we like sleep, we freeze, we bleed, and we don't always succeed. We crawl, we break, we fall on our knees while the people that love us stand above us and leave. How can safety be a concept in which we believe when there's cycles outside? And friends just waiting to fill you back with knives when you look out of eyes that risk us. Like a never ending driving test, and no one's noticed your mind's untethered, and you don't know how long you can hold yourself together because you've been doing this for as long as you can remember because you're just a ball of mass without a center. Because your brain is a lens you don't always know how to change. A lens filled with cracks that you can't erase. But what if the cracks in the lens let same light? A light that illuminates how to survive and maybe perhaps with a little more time can remove these lens from your tired eyes and let them see beyond just the next day. And I know now this hope seems like an imaginary place, so imagine. Imagine these cracks attack you to separate the blood from the water that with these cracks your life is now broader, fuller, full of love because these cracks have opened you up. So stop hiding away in your shame and burning and realise it might be your time to stop hurting soon. Because to every night there's a moon, to every dark there's a light and that very same concept in fact applies to you. It's happening on your insides because we go through our cycles just like the moon. But the moon isn't for something you want to remember. Thank you. Okay, talk to me guys. Some words for what you just heard. 